The internship program is a little bit in between an academic program and the PACE program. It's somewhere of something of a bridging experience in that it's taking a specific and kind of focused learning experience and directly applying it to what, it, what the potential applications are in, in the workforce. I didn't really know what to expect, I'll be honest. I've never sort of worked in a corporate environment before uh, or anything similar. And it, I was pleasantly surprised. It was sort of a mix of professionalism and just like laid back easiness. And it's, it's quite a fun environment. And it's a, it's a, for me, it's a good learning environment as well as a working environment. Through direct experience with our own team members who are working in it themselves, um, to an understanding of the possibilities through the projects that we do in the internship. Here is not just a workplace, but also it's like a small uni. So we learn while we're working. So it's, it's not really stressful. So we ran these series of workshops utilizing the expertise that we had across the Learning Innovation Hub. And the aim was to be able to upskill and better prepare um, the students for their employment past university. And I was also really pleasantly surprised by the amount of sort of almost classes we had that everyone sort of took time out of their work to teach us these skills and to sit down and go now we're going to teach you how to do this and focus on this one task and being able to actually have that sort of teacher relationship was really great. So all the projects were real. We put out a call across the university for academics who needed work done. Um, we got a lot of interest from, from right across the university. There was different levels of complexity involved, uh, so we got to teach them some new skills while also uh, honing some skills that they already had. They're real projects that will actually be used in learning and teaching. Yeah, I definitely feel like I did connect a lot more with the community and kind of got a wider understanding of what media means to different faculties and different stakeholders. It was exciting getting to work with real clients because not only did I get to work on real projects, but also I got to learn how a lot of different projects come to life. So a lot of these skills are transferable on a macro level in knowing how to direct and work with a client to get the shot from knowing how to move a conversation closer to getting that sound bite from knowing how to problem solve on location and problem solving confidently. Things like shooting video and working to a brief are also transferable skills that will help any media student to hone the skills that they've learnt about in their degrees and sort of help them understand how it works in the real world. The more hats you can wear in a media role, the more valuable you become. This is meant to be a symbiotic experience in the sense that this isn't just a, a, a unidirectional kind of interaction. It's really meant to be as rich an experience for our team members, the, the educational media producers, the learning designers involved, or the faculties who are involved, as well as for the students. And so I think that that is not necessarily unique to this internship experience, but it's not in every internship experience. And that's something that I think is really important to continue to foster and grow for us as well is to really find a way to make it as, as rich and valuable for the mentors and the, 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 the producers and learning designers as it is for the, the interns themselves.